What is up, cutie gang? My name is Till Giran, and you're watching Artifacts, the cool stories about the cool stuff we can find here at Quantic Dream. And today's story is about... Ta-da! <laughs> a box. But hear me out. This is not just a random box. First, it's beautiful. Look at this handmade, beautiful piece of woodcraft. Because, obviously, you have to respect wood. Do you respect wood? And look, if you do this, and then this. It's a music box. And you might have recognized that tune. Yes, because it's Connor theme in Detroit Become Human. This box was specially made by Nima Fokora, one of the three composers who worked on the game score. The score that is, by the way, available in vinyl. For the young people, this is actually a very old type of MP3. Because yes, Quantic Dream is known for highly cinematic and storytelling driven games, but music is also a big part of the studio's DNA. And FYI, David Cage, the studio founder, started his career by working for a record label and he made music for video games. He then created his own company and produced soundtracks for different type of projects. Notably, video games like Cheese Catastrophe, starring Speedy Gonzales in 1995, and the same year on Time Cop. And then, obviously, well, he founded Quantic Dream. But he never forgot his love for cool tunes. That's why, when he started working on Detroit, he asked three composers to work on the original soundtrack. Philip Shepard, who produced the music for Cara. It was done at Abbey Road Studio with the English Session Orchestra. John Paisano, who actually did the music for Marcus. And last but not least, Nima for Cara created the soundtrack for Connor. He did it by creating custom instruments. And he used vintage synthesizer in order that the sound would represent the robotic nature of Connor. And David even played himself the opening theme of Detroit. That's why this box is very important. Because it represents the strong relationship between the studio and music. And breaking news! I am going to be the one who will be composing the next game score by just doing this. It may or may not be a blatant lie. But that's another story. 